are reacting to? Stray Kids. Mirror performance video. Yeah, Stray yeah. Kids. I heard they were coming to KCON New York. I really hope they're coming to KCON LA too. Please, Stray Kids, please come to KCON LA because I need to support your guys in person. I agree. We're real shooting for these artist stuff this year. I'm so affected. <laughs> I just want to support you guys, honestly, at KCON. But we live in California, so there's no way I can make it out to New York. Um, so, come to KCON LA. Please, if you guys see this video in time, talk to, you, to whoever deals with that shit. Right? Let us interview you. Yeah, just show up. Yeah, this is great. So, um, I'm excited. This was requested to us, and we were more than happy to do it. I didn't know that there was a performance video for this song, but... That's irrelevant because here we are reacting to it. You guys let us know and we heard your calls. I am ready. <laughs> so, should we just get into it? Let's do it. Ah, okay. <laughs> oh, I'm so ready. No, I'm not. Oh, that's cool. Right? I like I like that mirroring. That mirror. <laughs> okay, I see what you're doing here. Oh, these lyrics are deep. I'm seriously trying not to die right now. <laughs> oh, he just like Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> wow, he has a jawline. I think you say this every time. <laughs> I would dry all my tears. <laughs> Come here, my children. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> the haircut looks good on you. Mm -hmm. Here we go. His his voice sounds way too deep. I know every time. <laughs> I'm like, how old is he? he he's like, I'm, I is he younger than me? I don't know. I think he is. I'm still having I'm still struggling with learning who everyone is. Are there's like two ninety sevens I think. And then everyone else is like 99 lower. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> oh I'm so offended. Oh, the dance in the rain. I know. Well, that's a look at a concept I support. <laughs> okay, the guy who is just like 
because this part just was. I feel like he should be the one with the like, like his voice would fit the one that has the deep voice. Isn't that like deep voice? Like, switch. Isn't that Felix? He has such a baby face. He does. But like a super like manly voice. I'm like, when he speaks regularly, it's not that deep, right? I don't think it is. I don't, I'd have to double check on that because I don't think it I is don't, either. But at this point, I'm not even sure. I'm like, I wouldn't be able to listen to him sing or like do anything. If that's like, that's his, the voice that he always uses. I think the reason why we remember Felix so much is because I'm that pretty whole, sure- That whole controversy with him. Yeah, or well, I wouldn't necessarily call oh. it a controversy, but that stupid stuff that was pulled by Jerry P that had us triggered AF. <laughs> yeah. I think that's why, like, we're we're so we're hold, we hold on to Felix so much. We need to protect him <laughs> at all costs, you guys. And then he like raps, and it's like, oh, you don't need our protection. But then like you see his face, and you're in, you remember how old he is, and remember what he went through, and yeah. you're like, oh, my child. And then like, but at the same time, you remember that, and then, <laughs> um. Sorry, you like rolled your eyes and it caught me off guard. My my contact, my contact still bothering me. Um, and then at the same time, <laughs> sorry, I'm not trying to do it. I just won't look at her. <laughs> After you remember all that, you remember like, oh shit, literally like two members, I think. I say two, but then again, I don't know for sure, so I don't remember. Are like my age, and then everyone else is younger, and they've all been through shit. Like, and then my whole heart just bleeds for these children. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> They're little children. Ugh. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> and I'm so attached to them, and I want to see them succeed, and I want them to go through KCON LA so I can support them. Like, let's get Stray Kids recognized. Yes. Also, yes. Stray Kids, you get recognized if you're on our channel. Just saying. We can give you the, the, the end that you need. We got you. Everyone needs to appreciate Stray Kids. We're on this wagon. Yeah. Everyone else needs to join us. We got you guys. For, we promote the shit out of you guys if you just let us. Me and, me and Aria love a good underdog story. Yes. And right now, Stray Kids are the underdogs. They really are. Like, they deserve so much more than what they're giving. Because <laughs> they're talented. The thing is, like, they're so talented. Also, hold on. That reminds me. I heard recently some things about Stray Kids. Do we talk about this in our other video? I feel like we may have talked about this in our other video, but I'm gonna say it again because I'm still triggered by it. But we heard some things about Stray Kids being compared to another oh, popular yeah, boy. Don't group. even get me started. <laughs> First of all, <laughs> If you're gonna compare straight kids to a specific group, you might as well compare straight kids to a lot of fucking groups. Because there are groups besides this one that they were being compared to that do their own shit. So give these fucking children a chance. Let them grow a little bit. Let's bring it down. <laughs> um, don't even. We're very protective over straight kids if you can't tell. I will. N <laughs> Come at my boys. Like. We just think that Stray Kids deserves a lot. Yeah. They're super talented they really in dancing are. and writing. Like, and like, I think they do a little bit, like a very little of their own producing. Like, they're fucking starting out. Give these guys a chance to fucking grow. They literally started from the bottom. Like, and, and the thing about Stray Kids too is, if I'm not mistaken, like, the the leader is the one who picked all of these members to be in the group like this was not just like people who were thrown together and was like oh you're gonna like debut with this group and you don't have a chance like mm -hmm. they were specifically chosen to be a part of this group and jyp gave them the opportunity to be like do you yeah, and not only like that, but like even Stray Kids. Stray Kids is like OT9 or OT9. Like, yeah. Like, they're like this, and there's nine of them. 
I mean, granted, 17 is like this and there's 13, but you know, they've been around for a good while. And they were all training together. Like everyone who was like training, training together pretty much like went into mm -hmm. uh, 17. Yeah. So that's a little bit different too though, because it wasn't like, it wasn't like in, the, in that scenario, it wasn't like S Coops chose all these members. And even with groups like, you know, um, that have been in other like survival programs, mm -hmm. um, like Monster X, like they kind of like, well, for example, I am. They hated I am when I am first <laughs> came in because like they felt he didn't deserve it. But now they're all close. And then when you look at like um, even BTS, like BTS, they some members almost left, some members almost didn't make it. And BTS was originally a completely different group starting off than when they debuted and like got all their members together. Like they were supposed to be a hip hop, like rap group kind of thing. And- But not like the shit that they're producing. <laughs> yeah. Like, don't even, you guys. So to compare Stray Kids to all these other groups, I feel like that's, there, there's no basis for it because yeah. they're completely different from the start to the finish. Their sound, like what, just because they have, you know, a bit of an like, edgier sound and they have like multiple rappers like that's exactly what rachel's saying they're it's like it's a fucking group who surely could have you know more or less like the same group concept in a very weird way if you look at it certainly um but there's no reason or, or no, there's no need to compare these kids to anyone else. You're gonna you're gonna find similarities no In matter everything. yeah, no matter what what genre there is. Like it's really hard to find groups, bands, whatever, that don't have similarities somewhere else. That does not mean they are trying to be this person or like whatever. You know, they may look up to like this person, this group, this artist or whatever, and that's all fine and dandy. Like you need to get your inspiration from somewhere. But to give them hell because, like, you know, started from the bottom, now we're here, like, that's not fair. Yeah, exactly. So, stop. <laughs> support Stray Kids. Support and everything kids. that they are. Me and Aria, me and Aria have been pretty good at calling out groups who, who, are, who are going somewhere. Groups that we see potential in. I don't know if you guys want to go all the way back and watch one of our like first Monster X videos. I, I, we called it. We're like, you know, these guys are going somewhere and now they're like selling out tours and we can't even get tickets. That's neither here nor there. Oh, shots fired. But <laughs> it's okay. I saw, we saw one host shirtless once. So Lord forbid we see him again. Couldn't have that. Also, we wish us luck when we try to get those BTS tickets because I don't think we'll be able to. You're putting the bad vibes out. Sorry. You're also, right. this is about stray kids. You're right. <laughs> we see potential in stray kids. Mm -hmm. And it's not just because they're underdogs, but it's because they are legitimately talented. Yeah, they have potential. There is potential in these boys. Fucking give them a chance. <laughs> Straight up. Straight up. So as for the song goes, as for the dancing, love the dancing. I really like like the mirror, uh, uh, the mirror effect that they did like while dancing. That was super cool and That's it was cool. very like aesthetic looking. Yeah. And the song the lyrics were deep. The Always. and the sound like I I dig this a lot. I, but I, like I dig Stray Kids so. Yeah. Everyone get on our level. Same. <laughs> So, with that being said, thank you guys for joining us. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Also, don't forget to check out our social media pages, which will be listed down below and on the next page. And don't forget to check out our live stream on the weekends. You can find us at twitch.tv slash hellocasanova. You'll know when we go live, because we'll post on our social media. Once again, thank you guys for joining us, and we look forward to seeing you guys again next time. What